Let's see what Unc is talking about. Let's see what Uncle Joe is talking about. What's up, Unc? All right. So it says, it says, confused Joe Biden makes bizarre statement following Hurricane Milton. Um, let's look at this. Hurricane Milton wreaked havoc on Florida. Biden has broken his silence after Hurricane Milton wreaked havoc on Florida. The president emerged for a quick press briefing, but instead of focusing on the current weather situation and recovery effort, he bizarrely spent the time blasting Donald Trump. When asked if he had spoken to Donald Trump at all, Joe Biden became agitated and blasted the former president, telling him to get a life and help these people. Have you spoken before President Trump at all? Uh, Are you kidding me? <laughs> Mr. President Trump. I'll be honest, I don't necessarily think that's bizarre. Why are you asking Joe Biden if he spoke to Trump regarding the hurricane relief? I mean, I guess you could, but I, I get why Joe Biden would have that response. Like, are you kidding me? Like, we're having a press conference about Hurricane Milton and you're asking me if I spoke to Trump? Now, some people may say, well, he's the former president. He's helping out down there. Maybe you would have a conversation with him. I don't know. But let's continue to see what, what he said after that. You kidding me? <laughs> Mr. President Trump, former President Trump, get a life, man. Help these people. Will you hold him accountable? You said you were going to... What's funny is Trump actually is helping a lot of the... Well, they may go through it on this. Hold this accountable. Public will hold him accountable. You better impress hold him accountable because you know the truth. Will you, do you plan to speak with former President Trump? No. The remarks drew criticism from social media, particularly because Donald Trump provided free accommodation to frontline emergency service workers in his Miami hotel. This commentator blasted Joe Biden, saying, Donald Trump has personally been on the ground in states devastated by Hurricane Helene, as well as opening up his hotels in Florida to those preparing to help repair the state in the wake of Hurricane Milton. This commentator agreed, saying, Trump hasn't been in office in nearly four years, yet he still traveled to the areas impacted by the hurricane. And in another bizarre turn during the statement, Joe- This is where the bizarre stuff comes in. Listen to this. Joe Biden said Israeli Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu will be helping with the hurricane cleanup. Mr. President, what, um, what did you, uh, what did Prime Minister Netanyahu tell you about his plans uh, releasing to retaliation? He's coming over to help with the storm. Commentators on what? Did he just say that Netanyahu is coming over here to help with the storm? Now I may be totally off with this, but that sounds a little bit. Bizarre. Listen to Mr. this. Mr. President, what, um, what did you, uh, what did Prime Minister Netanyahu tell you about his plans uh, releasing to retaliation? He's coming over to help with the storm. Commentators on social media were shocked, saying, Reporter asks Joe Biden what Prime Minister Netanyahu told him about plans to retaliate against Iran. Biden responded that he is coming to help with the hurricane in Florida. The leader of the free world? Joe Biden's strange comments come after his VP and Democratic nominee Kamala Harris was slammed for her own bizarre gaffe during a Hurricane Milton briefing where she was recorded covering her mouth while speaking to an aide. It flood, uh, our, we really got to watch those those areas and those yeah, communities. So it takes quite a while for that water to drain. Look at Kamala getting caught Thank on you very board. much. Hey, Ken, I have a question for you. You, you mentioned words matter and I'm... Um, Kamala got the earpiece. I don't know if y'all just peeped that. So she was on a Zoom, and I guess she didn't know that her her mic wasn't muted, or she thought that covering her mouth would mute it. I don't know, but I, I clearly, I mean, it doesn't sound like anybody else is in the room telling her information. It sounds like, um, or, or maybe somebody held up something. I don't know. I don't know. That's just that. I, know I, I didn't really a lot care of, about this um, media following this this briefing. Comment. All right, I didn't really care about this, like that aspect of it. We get on Kamala enough. 
in in it's Dak. Just want to thank you for checking out our video and visiting the OG network. If you enjoyed the video, please make sure that you give us a like. And if you're looking to join a community of inspired individuals striving for purposeful abundance, subscribe. And if you're feeling real generous, share the video with some friends and family. All right, I'll see y'all soon. Ew.